Hello everyone, Anna B. Box Breaks doing a box break on a 2015-16 Leaf Signature Series. Show you the uh, time and date. It is 11:52, August 29th, and we're gonna go ahead and show you. Sorry, let me just—I gotta open this window here and show you all the spots. There you go. There's all 30 spots. Mercy Bow, and then a bunch of NAs. Not a lot of people want in this. I kind of had a feeling with it being such a high price point, but I thought with eight autographs and possible Connor McDavid, it would be a little hotter. But anyway, like I always say, I always do the break when the listing ends, no matter what. So here we go. We're going to randomize this list three times. There's one. There's two. And again, number three. You got NA at 1, down to DA Salty at 30, and randomize three times. Copy and paste. See NA at 1, down to DA Salty at 30. Alright, now we're going to do the teams. Again, we start in alphabetical order Anaheim to Winnipeg, and we randomize this list three times. There's one. There's two. And third and final. You got the New York Islanders at one, down to the Winnipeg Jets at 30, and you'll see randomized three times. We'll again copy and paste. You'll see the New York Honors at 1 down to Winnipeg at 30 and we'll show everyone their teams. Alright, there you go. Alright. Oh, I got the tape to tape my camera down. Okay. Alright, this box has 8 autograph cards in it. Obviously, the big card would be Connor McDavid. Let's see if we can get that. Also, there's a lot of, there's not a lot, but there's also current players. It could be in there too. Just so you know, if it is a retired player, and if for some reason if he's got, you know, a Canadian jersey or not an NHL jersey, and it doesn't have an NHL team on the card. Either the, it goes front and then back second, but on either side, let's say there's no NHL anywhere, then it would go to whatever team he's more pro played, you know, more prominently known for. So hopefully that doesn't happen. I, I, in fact, I haven't had that happen yet on anything, but I always like to say just in case on some of these. All right, so they're already in cases here, so we're just going to leave them like that. So we'll go one at a time here. All right, so the first card is Tanner Kaspik. Um, so a lot of these guys are going to be, you know, draft picks and stuff. So I'm going to have to, go let me Google their name and get who drafted them so we can uh, figure out what team gets them. Sometimes it takes a little bit. Especially if they're undrafted or let's see this kid. Oh, this kid's only 17, so he has not been drafted yet. Let me get that to come in a little clearer for you guys. I don't know if it was earlier, but I just looked at it. It's not my autofocus is having a tough time with the in the clear here. Come on, I think the glare off the. Uh, throwing us out there we go so there's the card I don't see a serial number on it okay let me um, look around here make sure I'm right but what I'm looking at on the hockey db.com it says he's 17 he's playing in the Western Hockey League sorry this is what kind of takes a little bit long with this yeah, top prospect eligible for the 2016 NHL draft. So he has not been drafted yet. 
So what we'll do is at the end, we're going to go back to the, uh, the list of spots and we're going to randomize it from where they're at three times and whoever's at number one is going to get that one. And same thing, we'll, he'll be number one. If there's another card like that, we'll do it again another three times from that spot and so on. So here's the next card. Jacob, I, I can't even pronounce that. Looks like somewhat very similar to the same card. No um, serial number on this. Backside, there we go. Let's uh, pull up his name and see if he uh, was drafted. I was excited for this box. I'm a big hockey guy and uh, with Upper Deck having the uh, the sole contract for hockey, there hasn't been a lot coming out lately, you know, waiting for the season to get started. Uh, let's see here. Uh, he's a prospect for the Boston Bruins. He was selected by the Bruins in the first round, 13th overall. All right, so this one's going to go to the Boston Bruins. Let me just, I want to write that down real quick. So I don't have to do this all over again later. So that's going to the Bruins. All right. All right, next card. Simon Stransky. Again, let's, uh, same prospect auto. Same card, no serial number. His name and see. Nice, we got a first round pick on the last card. I like the first card actually, the 17 year old kid. It says a high prospect for 16 draft. Uh, let's see, this kid could be the same thing. He is 17. He's playing in WHL for the Prince Albert Raiders. Let's pull up this other website. This is the one that said. This one. Uh, yes, prospect eligible for the 2016 draft. So, all right, so we'll do the uh, Tanner card first, then the Simon card second. All right, here's the fourth card here, Will Bitten. Again, same look, prospect auto. Seventeen-year-old. Let's see. Another seventeen-year-old prospect eligible for the sixteen draft. He played uh, with the Plymouth Whalers last year. Um, Fifteen goals, sixteen assists in sixty-three games. All right. So again, we'll do that with the. Uh, he'll be the third card. We'll do the same thing for. All right, so here we go. Here's a, what is this, the three, four, fifth card. All right, Ed uh, Gia Coleman. I, I, I heard of him, but I can't pronounce his last name. He's a goalie, New York Rangers. So this is going to go to the New York Rangers. Nice looking card there. I was just going to look. I think he's a... Uh, I'm pretty sure he's a Hall of Famer. Uh, before my time, but I think uh, I was just gonna look, but no, not really important. But there's a card, nice looking card. Got no serial number on it. All right, all right. Here is number six, Jonathan Ang. Now here's a green one. So here you see the green has it. Uh, now it's um. Numbered four out of five, so nice, really low number. Let's see, pull him up and see if I just pulled up the now it came out. Yeah, inducted the Hockey Hall of Fame in 1987. So took a while for my internet to get moving. All right, we're looking up Jonathan Ang. Uh, is he another 17-year-old? 
eligible for the 2016 NHL draft. Yeah, another 16-year-old playing for the Peter Peterborough Peets. Uh, 59 games, 10 goals, 10 assists. Um, so nice low number there. So he'll be the fourth card we will randomize off. All right, here's number seven, Phil Verchota. Miracle Team 1980, one out of 10. All right, so here we go. So this is something what I was telling you about. So he's got a USA hockey jersey. It's a USA card. So there's no, no um, indication of any NHL team. So let's see where Phil played, if at all. See, most of them went in the NHL for at least a little bit. Pretty cool 1980 team. Um, NHL draft. Let's see, 75th overall, 1976 Minnesota North Stars. Trying to, um, to be even. Yeah, it looks like. Uh, but then, he, yeah, so. If this is going to go to the uh, Minnesota North Stars, which is now the Dallas Stars, so this will go to Dallas. Opted to play overseas. Okay. I'm just reading about him. So he never actually played, but he was drafted by um, the uh, Minnesota North Stars. So it's going to go to the Dallas Stars. That's what team drafted him. It's the only affiliation he's had with any team. So it's going to go to the Dallas Stars. All right. And last card. Uh, okay, here we go. Glenn Anderson. Obviously, Edmonton Oilers. Number five out of five. Nice looking card there. A signature series dynasty. With the Edmonton Oilers. Nice looking card. And a nice, very low number there, four out of, or five out of five. All right, guys, that'll do. Oh, I'm, what am I talking about? All right, so now we're going to do Tanner. We're going to go back to the list where we ended off. Let me untape my camera here, guys, and show you. All right, so that's where we left off. That's where we copy and pasted from, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to randomize this list three times, and whoever's at number one is going to get this Tanner card. So there's one. There's two. And there's three. So eight ball, eight, eight, eight. You're going to get this Tanner card. So let me just write that down, guys. Apologize for the dogs barking. So Tanner, 8-Ball, you're getting Tanner Kaspik. I'll show you that card really quick again. That's the card that you're going to get. All right, now the next card was the Simon Stransky. Sorry, guys, I'm holding the camera in my hand, so it's a little shaky. So that's Simon. So we're going to do the same thing, but right where we left off, we'll randomize it again three times. There's one. Two and three, and that's going to go to NA. So that's no one's getting that one. All right, next one is going to be Will Bitten. Let me put it down so you guys can see it. Sorry, there's Will Bitten getting a huge glare here. So that's going to be Will Bitten. We'll do the same thing. We'll start again and go three times. One, two, and three. Again, an A. And the last card is going to be Jonathan Ang. And again, we'll start right where we left off. Again, three more times. One, two, and third and final time. It's also an A. Alright guys, so that'll do it. I wish more people would have gotten that break, but 
like I said, I, I, I open it no matter what because I don't want anyone waiting more than 30 days to, to do the break. So anytime you see spots out there, don't worry about it, guys. I'm going to do the break no matter what. When it is over, even if there's one spot, I'll still do it. Um, so anyway, um, please go to my website if you want. Prices are cheaper there. Um, if you're looking, I have some cool football, some new stuff, 2015 certified um, and a 2015 Inception. I'm really excited to open those up. The artifacts I've had before, uh, I've gotten some good luck on it. Again, I'm a huge hockey guy, not a lot out there, so I went and got this one. Uh, I thought it was a good price point. And um, a basketball, another good one. I did this one um, a few weeks back, and it was a pretty good box, so I went ahead and got another one. Again, really good price on that. I'm going to look get another Bowman baseball. I think that one went pretty quick, so I'll look for some more hockey. Maybe there'll be something coming out or anything new I will pick up. Um, so again, I guys, I appreciate it, and I will get these cards out on Monday. Uh, thanks again, and please, if you bought for me on eBay, please give me positive feedback. I'd appreciate it. Thank you.